If you do creative work or have free reign in your documents, fonts are as much of a design element as the rest of the objects on a page and can be used to express a certain degree of personality. That being said, you may feel a bit constrained by your font options that come out of the box. Luckily enough, installing more fonts to use on apps like Microsoft Word is a cinch. Here's what you need to do. To start, you'll need to have a font to add. If you don't already have a font on hand, you can find tons of fonts online on sites like defont.com, linked in the description below. Once you've found one, or if you already have one in mind, you'll need to ensure that it's in true type or open type format. These files end with TTF and OTF, respectively. After downloading your font's TTF or OTF file, double click it, and your computer will open the file in a font viewer. You'll see a preview of the font as it may be rendered in Microsoft Word. If the font doesn't appear to render correctly within the font view, it may not do so on Word itself, but you can still attempt to install and use the font. If you're willing to take the risk, simply click on Install, and your computer will install your selected font for you to use on Microsoft Word. You may need to restart the program to see the font listed as an option. If you are using Microsoft Office Online, you can use a locally installed font by typing in its exact font name into the font selection box, then tapping Enter. Office Online will attempt to retrieve your font to use from your local files. You may need to restart your browser for it to register your newly installed fonts. If you like this guide, make sure to like and subscribe for all sorts of videos covering Microsoft Word and other technology. And don't forget to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.